This is a quick walking tour of Puerto de Santiago. Chess game happening, and we are gonna go for a walk downtown. Are you guys ready to go discover the town? Yes, let's go. Okay, guys, we're gonna go to Puerto de Santiago and walk around, see what that town is all about. Okay, so we are walking from our hotel up here uh, next to Los Gigantes. Yeah, they cut the mountain up. Yeah, this is how they set up the foundation for the new building, a building like this. So now you know why a 10 minute walk to get groceries this morning. Fiz and I, we spent 40 minutes because we kept stopping, looking at the town, and the water. As we were walking down, we came across this gate in the middle of nowhere with a little bell and a door and a pathway, a lighted pathway going down. Yeah. Walking in uh, different countries and cities and discovering these little things like that, that's what excites us the most. We are there's a bunch of places in Tenerife where you can go. They're kind of like Times Square, a lot of souvenir shops and whatnot, but we generally try to find like local places. So now I keep calling this area the dog park, but it's actually not. It's a pathway that goes down, zigzag all the way down. This is the walkway we were on, and now we found this viewing spot. I say, out of all the viewing spots, this is definitely very impressive because you see the whole city in front of you. You're still at an elevation point. It's very easy to get to if you stay at Los Gigantes. There's a restaurant and a viewing point above us as well. Is he right? I am correct. Yeah. Puerto de Santiago, down below. Los Gigantes is this side, then Playa La Arena is that side. Oh, I'm still confused. What is this neighborhood called? I keep calling it Puerto de Santiago because that was the sign, but town. That is the Royal Sun Resort. That's our room up there. I'll just magnify it. And then you can see the size of the mountain behind us. Here's the way to Puerto de Santiago. It's about a 10 minute walk from the town and we're just enjoying the sunset. The sunset and just happened, we paused to take a picture. We just took these long stairs down. And now we're gonna turn left on Haya Hondura. The walk takes you through the residential area. I think I'm the only one holding a camera here, so no tourists. Yeah, very nice houses, right? They're apartments, yeah, it's all residential. We're gonna turn left 
There's a sign for Puerto de Santiago and it's telling us to turn left through here. So we took the side street next to this restaurant called La Pergola. Tenerife has definitely taken us aback a little bit. We um, are just so awe-inspired by its beauty. Uh, rocks and crashing waves and these beautiful buildings right uh, built right on the edge of cliffs and whatnot. It's just amazing. So this is Puerto de Santiago. It was worth the 20 minute walk down to watch this sunset. Now we are hightailing back to the hotel. You can actually see Los Gigantes in the back. Beautiful restaurant and a nice walkway all along on this side, heading down to look at beautiful buildings on top of a cliff. So there are many reasons why you would want to stay in Los Gigantes. If you're trying to stay away from touristy places, I highly recommend looking into Los Gigantes. You know, I think when I come back to Tenerife, we'll definitely pick this area to stay. Mom is doing a physical challenge of lifting Isa and climbing all these steps. Alia, should I tell them the real reason why you're doing the real this? The reason is, again, Isa is not well and I'm trying to save his energy. Okay, I don't know how you're doing this because I can't even talk and walk up. See how strong mom is? Yeah. Oh my god. Okay. How's you, how are you doing this? Metal arms inside? No, she's a robot. Yeah. I don't think she's a human being. And now it's getting dark. Heading back after watching the sunset at Playa de Santiago. That's our hotel over there. Can't even see Los Gigantes. And mom again, the rock star of this family carrying Isa from all the way down. Catch you guys next time. Gonna go in the blooper. <laughs> yeah, I was recording you. So you, his wants to pick up Isa. Yeah. And Isa, what do you think? How long his would last? You only last one second, dude. <laughs>